so welcome and welcome back to my channel guys this is jb23 vlog and for today's video guys i would like to share on how to break test of our mooring winch as you can see guys this is the mooring winch from aft port side and starboard side so this is the starboard side winch guys and uh, this maintenance is carried out in every six months interval guys why is it necessary so this is for safety reasons that the our uh, mooring winch are the brake pads can withstand at a certain load so in this case guys we carry out load test at 60 megapascal guys this is the mooring winch starboard side so as you can see guys we use the hydraulic hydraulic pump and the hydraulic jack and in the as you can see so these are the necessary tools used to break test guys first the hydraulic pump and the, of course the hydraulic jack and the special tools for brake test that you have to install follow the instruction book on how to carry out the load test guys first we have in every job in every business we have to follow the, the instruction book so as you can see guys that if the brake test or the pressure suddenly drops that means that you have to tight more the brake as you can see this is the brake when the pressure drops it means that the brake is need to adjust at a certain point that it can withstand at the 600 bar or 60 megapascal guys so again we need to pump until such time it can reach to 60 megapascal at this point now it is holding so it is holding at 60 megapascal so just put mark guys and from that point on that is the reference that, that break or from that reference it can withstand at a six, 600 bar or 60 megapascal so as you can see guys our chief officer is putting some mark in the brake so that's the reference point that it can withstand so let's proceed with the other winch again same procedure guys just follow the procedure and slowly increase the pressure just pump and once the pressure drops that means the brake needs to adjust or it needs to tight more as you can see in this case the brake is tight and it can withstand it can hold as you can see at 600 so until there it can withstand guys as you can see the brake is tight and now it can ready to put the mark so this is the these are the tools uh, special tools for uh, carrying out the brake test so just to install like that and for the jack support has to be installed also as you can see guys just insert that and there is a pin you have to put the pin and after that and after this job we can put the mark also that we have carried out the request so once again the frequency of this is in every 
six months interval. All mooring winches and mooring winches combined wind blast should be should be carry out with a brake test. So same procedure, guys. Just raise up the pressure, the pump. As you can see, it is dropping. As you can see, the pressure reaches at 14 in the Pascal. It drops. And as you can hear that the brake needs to retype or needs to adjust, needs to type more so it can hold and withstand with a 600 megapascal as you can see guys so again we we'll have to pump it more after tightening the brake we have to pump it more we will see if it can withstand with a 600 if it is not dropping then it is confirmed that the brake is still good you can see guys just slowly pump until 600 so until bar. here guys i hope you learned something about this video please don't forget to hit the like share and subscribe this is jb23 vlog thank you for watching bye bye